There's a big buzz around apartment hunting right now. Here are three tips that we use in corporate housing that will streamline your process in finding your next apartment. The first tip is you want to make sure that you're dealing with a responsive leasing office. How do you do that? Even better, why is that important? If you have something that you need, let's say that your air conditioner is not working, very common problem here in the Southwest, then you want to be sure that the maintenance staff are going to be there as soon as possible to take care of your situation. Something like air conditioning can quickly become a life-threatening situation in some cases. And so you want to make sure that you're dealing with a staff that understands, will get somebody to take care of you, or at least respond and give you an idea of when somebody can arrive to take care of your situation. So you want, number one, to have a responsive leasing office. Number two is look at those reviews. If an apartment community has less than four star reviews, I would be concerned about that. Here's why. If people are having a bad experience in an apartment community, they are going to be one of the first ones to tell people about it because they don't want anybody else to have the same negative experience. And what often happens is if one person has given a negative review, chances are there are other people at the community who have experienced the same problem. But if you see an apartment community that has four and five star reviews, chances are they're a reputable community that is responsive to the needs of their residents. So take a look at those reviews. Also, when it comes to the reviews, see how old they are. A lot of times apartment communities will change property management companies. And so an older review may have been under a different property management company. Finally, you want to take a look at rate changes. You may or may not be aware of this, but many apartment communities nowadays use a program that looks at what their vacancy is going to be like and how much they should charge for different kinds of leases. So the rate that you may be quoted today could change tomorrow. Check with that leasing office when you're going for a tour or you're on the phone with them and ask them, how do you come about with your rental rates? They have to be honest with you. They have to be transparent. Here's another little trick. If you're looking online, make sure you're looking incognito because if you're not, the website will track how many times you visited the pages and they'll do that in the normal mode. Incognito, they can't do that because if you're doing it in the normal mode, what happens is the website realizes that you are interested in the apartment and the rate could actually go so check back on that apartment community in the incognito mode and that way you're getting a fair look at what's going on. These are some of the things that we look at when we're looking for apartments for our corporate clients and they can be very beneficial to you as you're looking for your apartment. Thanks for watching this. Don't forget to subscribe so that when new content like this comes up you'll be the first one to hear it.